What's up, YouTube? Uh, my name's Jamal. This is my first Stay in that bitch. Stay in that bitch. Stay in that bitch. Hey, what's poppin', YouTube? It's your boy Jamal Beck. <laughs> second time today, or well, second time like back to back videos. Every time I start, damn planes on the fly. But um, anyway, what's up, y'all? How y'all doing today? You know what I'm saying? Boy Marley back with another video. Man, um, uh, I was gonna do a part two of the rear end paint uh today. But honestly, it's kind of, it's kind of, it's real windy outside, you know what I'm saying? So I didn't want to have the paint flying everywhere and then I had to get up close to it where you be having like overruns, like overspray and overruns, the paint running. So tomorrow is supposed to be a lot warmer. Also, I don't, I hope the wind dies down tomorrow. That way I could go ahead and get that red end painted. Um, but with that being said, it's still a nice day, um, and I do got some stuff to do today, so I'll take y'all with me. We're going to hit my brother Jeremy's house. Uh, we're going to work on his Mustang, the blue Mustang that y'all saw at, uh, I believe it was Reaper's Garage in one of my videos. Um, something like, it was real flu gazy that went on with it that, that caused a lot of issues, uh, so... Um, I don't know if I still have the footage of the other video I shot when me Con when me and Connor pulled up on my brother, but we pretty much broke the top half of the motor down, seeing how far the damage was and stuff like that. Um, he ordered all his parts and stuff like that, so we're going to try to get it running by this weekend, but we're going to start the day. I mean, we got some decent weather. It's kind of chilly over there where he stay at because it's a lake not too far, so I do got me a couple thermals and hoodies. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna pull up on them. I'm gonna check back in when I get over there and I'm gonna have him explain, you know what I'm saying, what happened uh, to the motor and stuff like that. He could tell you in better detail than I can. But uh, like, share, subscribe. Hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo, what's up with it, man? We back, checking in. I made it over to my bro house. How long the UPS, man? Yeah, I made it over to my bro house, though. Oh, uh, so yeah, we about to. Work on the Mustang. Um, I guess we could get an explanation of what happened, nigga, because I don't, I don't really know. Uh, up. <laughs> <Shit>. <laughs> Play up, that's all. Yeah, that's my big bro, Jeremy. You know? Low key, he the, up, you know what I'm saying? Dude. He the reason why I work on car. Hey, yo, it's crazy, no cap. I started working on Fords first. <laughs> And then I just got smart and saw that Chevy yeah, was cheapest. In, hey, right. This is what I learned how to race in. One just like this, except it was the uh, it was the hatch. The GT. Yeah, the GT. Now we, I got the coupe. You know what I'm saying? We ain't gonna disclose no motor sizes or whatever, but Big yeah, boy. yeah. That's what we working with. Uh, I'm not sure if I still got the video that I took when we broke the motor down, but. Um, yeah, so bro, what, what pretty much happened to the motor, though? Man, we got the hoe together, man. It was running and everything. Yeah. <clears throat> Damn, Cambo walked itself loose, man. Yeah, Cambo walked out. Um, so shit. Cam walked out. Lifters cracked. Yeah, a couple of lifters cracked, like I told y'all. Um, then it stripped the, of course, it stripped the, the threads out the cam boat. Uh, yeah, I'm going to show y'all these lifters. See them hoes? Crack right here. See if I can get it to focus. See, 
Lucky them bearings didn't come out of them ball bearings. Right, and everything. Oh, yeah, that whole thing cracked yeah, in right there. See? Mm -hmm. All that shit. And then, this one got scratched up real good. Yeah. This was about to crack. Basically, the vibration from, um, from that cam bolt backing out. Right. The vibration from that bolt backing out, making that, causing causing a lot of vibration in that uh, drive, in that valve train. Right, right. And made them lifters crack. What's up, man? What's up, boss man? Coming up. I forgot he was out. He probably looking like, damn, not today. <laughs> that was oh, <laughs> <You're>... <laughs> so yeah, pretty much last time we was over here, um, I pretty much, well, I didn't, uh, Jeremy, I helped a little bit. We pretty much got the motor broke back down. The plan of it is, is try to flush it. It did have a little bit of metal shavings uh, in the oil. Right but yeah, that's the that's the boat that walked out. Yeah. Um, was, uh, I think we were supposed to use uh, Loctite on that boat when we assembled the motor. And, 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 and to be to be clear, you know what I'm saying? It wasn't the shop. Like we took the like we built the motor at home. You know what I'm saying? And then we took it up there, and they just installed it and got it running. And I stuff like that, and they did, the did the yeah, and they did like the wiring, yeah. Well, yeah, because it was the motor was already in there. Yeah, the motor was all that shit was done. Transmission was done, everything. Yeah, they just pretty much wired it, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna show y'all that too. But they did the electric system, and then they did the fuel. Right, right, right. And uh, so pretty much this this wasn't a, a mess up on Reaper's Garage because this is the this the car from that was getting built at Reaper's Garage. Uh, this this is nothing on them. Um, you know what I'm saying? It, it's something that you know we possibly did, but you know it's fixable. Hopefully, it's savable, and, and we're just gonna go back. We're gonna go back up with it. We're gonna uh, flush it. Uh, got a new cam. Got new lifters. Uh, did you get new push rods? Nah, they was right. They was right? The push rods was right. Okay, so the push rods were the, were the right length or are. Um, so, yeah. So, we just going to go back up with it, man, and hopefully everything be all right. The plan is to, it is, what, Tuesday? The plan is, is to have it running by this weekend. But, like I said, we both work full-time jobs and stuff. He drive trucks. I work, you know, for... Peloton and stuff like this, so you know we just get out here and work on these cars when we can. But.
that screwdriver right there. Hold on. So you might want to pick it up and record this part. There Proper lubrication of the camshaft. Right. Got to loop that thing up. Sticky, boy. <laughs> that be like some nut, don't it? <laughs> Sure shit. None of that bullshit. Alright, here we go. Little by little. Y'all see they ain't like no no Chevy cam how it got the, the three holes in the front. Oh yeah. Cause I usually bolts. yeah, I I put like uh what Brad taught me to put like uh three bolts in there. Yeah, and then use you that to got it in. Yep. So we only got one. Yeah. Get that motherfucker right there again. Oh yeah, he's trying. We get the shit on video too, so we know we did the shit right. You hear me? <laughs> <laughs> For real. I'm gonna try to edit this how I might drink it tonight. Shit, take your time with your work, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Little bit right. Alright, now I'm about to need that screwdriver. In. Right. in there. In there like swimwear. Alright man, so we're checking in again. As y'all can see we got the cam in. You know what I'm saying? Everything right. Right now, putting the Loctite on the boats that we didn't put Loctite on the first time. All right, very important part, y'all. 
every time you see a cam installed on the internet, and I did a little bit of research too, and I never found it. I just happened to come across the information when I was buying my parts. But um, make sure that you got your camshaft retainer installed properly, because that cam will walk out on you. This is a camshaft retainer. It's for a Ford. Yeah. They got different ones for Chevy and shit. But make sure you put this motherfucker on there. Cause that bitch will fuck you over. Like my last bitch. Nah, I'm bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> I get to it with them. I do. I gotta live here. You don't. <laughs> right. Hose. It's supposed to go in them. It got three. No. Oh, here it goes right there. Yeah. Play this fuck up, man. <laughs> Bro, it ain't no good hood spots to eat over here. You remember they had the catfish cuisine down there, bro? The nigga yeah, down used to have a jerk chicken. Get the fuck off me. <laughs> they used to have a jerk chicken in there, though. Yeah. But shit, uh, the spots I used to go to used to, used to be a good burger spot over there off of Pioneer. Mm -hmm. They gone. It's a decent seafood place over there, Arkansas, by that Kroger. Oh, yeah. You know, you stay right there. Right, right, Talking right. Talking about, uh, what's the name? Krispies. Yeah. Them and it's another one. Well, I don't know if they moved, though. Who, Krispies? Yeah. Where? What's up, Pop? Hey, how's it going? How's it going? Oh, man. I'm chilling, man. How you, out? How you doing? What y'all got going on here? Got the new cam in. Oh, you don't put it in already? Yep. Yeah. Cleaned everything up. Cleaned the, the, the valley up. I right, up there watching TV. Almost watching TV. was almost watching me. I think he was up there sleeping. Yeah. Sit there for a long time. I'll doze. Oh, yeah. That's me all the time. I want my neck feel the way it do now. Falling asleep. Did you get the new washer? Too. The one you dropped in the, in the uh, oil yeah, pan? Yeah, that's this one. Oh, that's that thing there? Yeah. Make sure that thing is in that hole like it's supposed to where it won't break off this time. That's what broke, huh? Not yet. Huh? Not yet. I not got there yet. A whole bunch of gloves in my truck. You could have had them black ones. You had some? Yep. You bought some? Yep. Oh, 20, shit. 20 bucks. I got a whole box. I got blue ones and the black ones. 
Every time I go to the truck, I'll bring them black ones back. I don't need them in the truck. Got too much shit in there now. It's not high enough. Can you see? Yeah, a little bit. You ain't got no drop cord light. Set the motor at top dead center. Gotta line that up. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Molly back with another video. Um, this the day after we, after I went over my brother's house and helped him with the Mustang and stuff like that. I had realized that I uh, didn't shoot an outro, or yeah, I guess that's what you'll call it. Yeah, an outro or whatever. Um, <laughs> that sound weird, but whatever. Uh, but yeah, I didn't shoot one and. Um, we did end up we did end up getting the time and chain and gear and stuff on there um and then it got dark and then my phone died so uh that's why i didn't shoot one or whatnot so i'm uh I, I think i did get a couple pictures before my phone died so i'm gonna drop those in there uh at the end of this video um I'm doing two videos today. Well, I'm doing this little outro right here to conclude the video. Uh, I guess that'll be part one or two of the Mustang or whatnot. And then um, I'm going to shoot my video for me painting my rear end. So um, I just appreciate y'all, you know what I'm saying, locking in with me. Like, share, subscribe, comment, uh, hit the bell notification so y'all know when I drop. And, uh, yeah, we're going to get at y'all. Bye.